Governor Abubakar Sani Bello has commissioned 21 vehicles to support the new Niger State Traffic Management Agency. The agency is expected to help curb growing security challenges through the use of technology. Chenemi Bamiyi reports. On July 28, 2021, Governor Bello assented to the laws establishing the Agency for Vehicular Administration as well as that of an agency for traffic management in the state. The Traffic Management Agency is to ensure general superintendence and management of the road and waterway traffic matters, deter and apprehend road traffic and waterway offenders, as well as establish and maintain a traffic information and control center. Today, the governor is backing up the operation of this agency with the provision of 10 power bikes, six Hilux van, four towing vans and one ambulance. Governor Bello outlines his expectations from the agency to include building and developing a culture of law-abiding road users through sensitization and enforcement of regulations. It will use some of the madness we see in Mina. People parking anyhow, people breaking laws anyhow, people doing things because they feel nobody can touch them. I think there are laws. I, as governor, when I come to traffic lights, I stop. I stop. With my convoy, and my convoy knows better that when we could get to traffic lights, we stop. And this is for the safety of everyone. You are expected to see one, a smooth transportation system in Nigeria. State two, you see with the mentality of people must have to change towards obeying traffic regulations. You will also realize that it is that have to do with overloading and indiscriminate traffic are going to be controlled. The agency will also be responsible for the administration, control and management of road traffic matters. Part of the goal of using technology in the road management system in Niger State is not just to curb the excesses of road transport users, but also serve as a security watch to monitor vehicle movement to be able to track activities of banditry around the state. Chenemi Bamei, TVC News, Mina.